My name is Robert Cameron. I'm an AMP member that have been around for about 12 years with AMP, and I work for Hempel USA. Hello, I'm Kat Coronado with International Paint. I've been an AMP member now for about 40 years. My name is Ardian Koplico, and I am a materials and corrosion engineer that work for BP in Houston. And I have been an AMP member for more than 30 years. I've been involved in the AMP committees for about 10 years. Loosely, not very intimately involved, but the last five years I've been uh, involved more intimately and committed as a volunteer with the Surface Preparation Committee. I've been involved in AMP committees basically since I started uh, dealing with AMP and, and SSPC. Uh, slowly, a little at a time, I started out working in, in uh, task groups and that evolved into SDG. Uh, I became an SDG chair for SDG 02 and 04. After SDG chair, I became the technology coordinator for C1. Again, has to do with coatings. Uh, and after technology coordinator for C1, I was the RPC chair, uh, Reference Publications Committee for about three years. Uh, then I became the TCC chair. I was TCC chair when the merger took place. And at that point, I became the technical program committee chair. We call it TPC for AMP. I have been involved in AMP committees for the last 15 years. I have been a um, symposium chair, has been a TG chair for two TGs, TG 299, and another TG that built the first standard on erosion management for oil and gas industry. Then I became an STG chair of STG 32, and I have been a member of TCC and now TPC. I am also the chair of Standard Committee 8 for material selection and testing. It is important to be in AMP committees because you can give your contribution to the improvement of procedures, processes, standards that improve the efficiency and the efficacy of our standards, our technical reports. We work with different groups of people. We work with input from different backgrounds and that enriches what we do and the products we deliver. First and foremost, I attend to serve as a the volunteering chair for SCO5. So I'm there to facilitate our meetings and to have a regular update to the organization about what's happening in our standards committee uh, with the new projects and the development of new standards. I also attend because I enjoy networking. I enjoy meeting with colleagues outside of the work environment. Uh, you know, we usually meet in offices, but here's a chance to go meet in a nice, you know, hotel, resort, or, you know, conference center as well as it gives us a chance to maybe have those moments when we can have that cup of coffee or that dinner with someone that we really have been meaning to catch up with, a customer, or colleague, etc. So who would benefit from attending SDE? And why would they benefit from this? Well, who would benefit is anybody involved in corrosion in any sort of way. That could be a vendor, that could be anybody, a craftsman, it could be somebody that's involved in, in, in inhibitors, it could be cathodic protection. Anybody that's involved in corrosion control in any form would benefit from it. And also they bring their expertise, so we would benefit from their attendance and bringing their expertise, their knowledge, their experiences uh, back into the group. Now, why would they benefit from it? From an education point of view. From an education point of view, there's no better way, there's no better way to gain experience, to gain education and knowledge actually. But also in a commercial way, suppose you're a vendor, suppose you sell something. This is an excellent place to meet customers and it's an excellent place for customers to meet you. I am looking forward to attending STE this year primarily because we have two projects that are ready to be published that handle two new technologies in the Surface Preparation Committee. So I'd like to see that, 
that progress and that development. So that's personally why I'm very excited about it. What I'm looking forward to in SDE for this year is actually meeting face to face with some folks that I've been dealing with for basically a year, a year and a half now as TPC chair. That, and we talk, we meet once a month, but we rarely meet and we almost never see each other face to face. I'm looking forward attending the conference because I'm looking forward to meet people, first of all, and then attend the different sessions of working on standards, working on technical reports, and technology exchanges.